ITP, okay, ITP, it's a blood disorder where cells like the platelets, they're deficient and uh, that uh, can cause you delayed blood clotting. That is your ITP. So what's going to happen again, the presenting complaint could be a uh, uh, could be tiredness or could be bleeding as well, like the gum bleeding or any bleeding. One very important thing that you're going to get in the, these cases would be the recent history of fever flu-like symptom. Re recent history of fever flu-like symptom. That's very typical, right? And that's the reason patient might be having uh, uh, all those symptoms. After that, patient might have started having these symptoms. Now, what is going to be the problem? Platelets are low, so bleeding, bruising. That is what you have to look for, right? So bleeding from anywhere, nose bleeding, urine, hematuria, blood in the stool, right? And easy bruising, obviously. He'll ask for other blood disorders, any blood thinners, patient is taking trauma. That is something you're going to ask. If the presenting complaint is tiredness, you need to rule out cancer, you need to rule out thyroid as well, right? Uh, what's going to happen is uh, sometimes there's no cause behind it and you just have it idiopathic most of the time. Otherwise, you can ask for radiation exposure. Family history is going to be very, very important as well. These patients, as they have got bleeding, they may have got a very heavy period as well. So psychosocial history, this is what you have to take. Uh, general physical examination, vitals, abdominal examination, uh, you have to do. Uh, bleeding clotting profile that you can check how you are going to treat these patients. So, I mean, you have to see what the symptoms are. So if the patient has got too much of bleeding, we may be going for uh, tranexamic acid as well. So injections can be given to the patient. I mean, as I mentioned, patient might have a history of recent fever flu or patient is still having fever flu. You can treat that uh, symptomatically as well. Now, what is the main treatment that you need to mention for ITP? That is steroids. So don't miss the thing that is steroids, right? Uh, Sometimes, yes, immunosuppressants, DMARDs, you may have to do. Uh, severe cases, severe cases, we may have to go for uh, spleen removal as well. So in rare cases, we may have to go for splenectomy as well, right? So main treatment is symptomatic. You go for steroid. Don't forget steroid. And we may have to go for splenectomy as well. Again, please do not miss the follow-up. Please do not miss the warning signs as well. So these are the things that you need to mention in IT.